feels pretty ordinary here. I was expecting some kind of sense of impending doom. Could it be that because you're here with me, I'm feeling more at ease? <laughs> I for one am getting a strong sense of treasure in the area. Let's hurry up. Onward. This room setup seems to be somewhat tricky. The things that stand out are the two mechanisms in front of us. One on the left, and one on the right. But, it seems like there's some sort of danger lurking around the mechanisms. If my years of adventure experience are anything to go by, it would be a disaster if we activated the wrong mechanism. <laughs> How about letting me try it out first? Huh. I could try it out myself. But, what do you think we should do? Let's do it your way. Well, that's a possibility. Yeah. Let's try it then. I'll take the right side, you take the left. Go stand by the mechanism. And when we're both ready, let's trigger them. open we got it right good thing we went with your idea huh you definitely live up to your reputation and i haven't had this feeling of working together with friends in ages i've really missed it <laughs> anyway let's move on So this room has four mechanisms, which means that's what I'm thinking, based on the last room. I think we're going to need four people to trigger all the mechanisms at the same time. Ah, if only the rest of Benny's adventure team were here. I hate to admit it, but the truth is, it's gone. It remains in name alone. The only reason Catherine hasn't deregistered Benny's adventure team is because she took pity on me. In fact, oh, the number of adventurers on the team has been below the registration requirements for a long time already. <laughs> yeah, Royce, Heckler, and Jack were all members of Benny's adventure team. A lot of things went down, but it mostly ended because of my bad luck. I completely understand why they quit the team. I'd never want to put them in danger on my account. <sighs> yeah, I felt really let down at first. But I'm pretty much used to it now. It's okay. Even though I'm the only one left on Benny's adventure team, one day, I'm gonna make sure its name is known all over to that. <laughs> Thank you. Let's focus on the problem at hand. Uh, sorry. The thought of the adventure team got me all sentimental. Now that I think about it more carefully, maybe we're making too many assumptions about the solution to these mechanisms. Exactly. Okay, I'll take a quick look at these mechanisms while you look around for any other clues. There doesn't seem to be anything here. Bets no one has been here in a long, long time. Hey, that looks like a notebook. Let's grab it and check it out with Bennett, shall we? Faster? Okay, faster. An adventurer's notebook? What's it doing here? Maybe it's got some clues on how to crack these mechanisms. Shall we take a look? 
Whoa, it really does have some information about them. It seems that the writer is holding something back. Well, since they place their hopes on future adventurers, we can't let them down. The notes say that the mechanism at the entrance needs to be controlled by someone continuously. But if the mechanisms are activated in the wrong sequence, the person in charge of the mechanism at the entrance will... Yeah, I guess that's what the notes are referring to when they say, Eric can't hold on anymore. Anyway, I'll take that role. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. Getting injured is just part of my daily routine. I'm pretty used to it by now. At the very least, I should be able to last longer than this Eric guy. <laughs> and more importantly, I trust you. You can definitely crack this mechanism puzzle, right? I mean, come on! Alright, alright. Let's just focus on solving these mechanisms. Remember what the notes say. The number of torches is not the hint for the activation sequence. Perhaps the sequence is related to the position of the torches on the ground. Well, don't put too much pressure on yourself just because you're afraid I'll get hurt. Just go with your gut and do it. I'm fine. Not scared. It's okay. If this is as bad as it gets, I can handle it. <laughs> I'm fine. Don't let me influence your thinking. You... you solved it? didn't really do anything. You're the one who nailed this. Let's go and open the chest, shall we? I can't wait! Wow, that was quite a haul. This must be the proudest moment for any adventurer. Not only getting the chest, but having this golden opportunity to join you on an adventure. For me, that's a pretty major treasure already. <laughs> really? Then I'm honored. <laughs> but there's one other thing that I find the most amazing of all. The fact that nothing really bad happened to us this whole adventure. This is the first time in my whole adventure career that it's ever turned out this way. That sounds very deep. But... I think I get what you're saying. You're saying that no matter how unlucky I might be, there'll always be times when luck is on my side, right? Yeah, this is a really big thing for me. And you know, I have a feeling that it was your kindness and goodwill towards me that helped me avoid a lot of bad luck, even find a little good luck. <laughs> it's a bit embarrassing to say that out loud, but all in all, thank you for everything. I hope I get to go on another adventure with you soon. <laughs>